The reason why I wanted to do this film was Michael Bay. The whole energy of this movie is something different than I've been a part of. Here we go! Michael Bay is the consummate action director of his time. He has a very specific stylistic approach to the way that he tells stories. And it has real stakes, emotional stakes. Suspects have hijacked a red and white ambulance. If I suspect fled from the parking garage. We meet Will, he's a veteran, and his wife has cancer and desperately needs this experimental surgery that the insurance will not cover. Danny has lived in a life of criminality, and he's also needing money in a different way. And so Will goes to ask for a favor from his brother. That's my brother. Doesn't look like your brother. Wow, that is original. Will is adopted, but they have a real brother relationship full of all the messiness and violence and love. He hasn't seen his brother for a long time for the right reasons. I will do anything for you, and all I'm asking is for you to do this one little thing for me. But at the end of the day, love makes you lower your standards. And now you're here asking me for help, and what am I giving you? I am giving you the world! Danny's getting what he's always wanted, which is his brother back. Let's go, D. Don't shoot a cop! Plans go awry, and they find themselves hijacking an ambulance. I'm gonna need you to help us. Why don't you help us? I got a cop shot. I gotta get him to the hospital. We don't get to see that a lot. You know, we don't get to see a female character make a decision between her own life or others. You need to help me. Go help me. Help the cop! I also really liked this woman at the center of a story who just doesn't take crap from anyone. Get the defib pads. Right chest, left ribs. My right or your right? His right. Moron. The power dynamics consistently changing. Because keeping the police officer alive is their only way to not get immediately killed by LAPD. Do you have EMT experience? Combat triage. And everything just becomes wild really quickly. I don't know what happened. They just started beating. He's about to die. We got an airship. We're sitting duck where we got to move. It felt like a small independent indie movie that we were doing in the back of an ambulance. And then I see the humongous explosion. I was like, oh, it's still a Michael Bay movie. Working with Michael Bay, it was just wild from the first day. I want the helo to come in from up here. He likes to do practical shots. And you're driving 80 miles an hour, shooting at a helicopter with another helicopter behind it. And I'm going, what's happening? <laughs> we're not the bad guys. We're just the guys trying to get home. I gotta get back to my wife and my son. Does your wife know you're up, Banks? Michael Love's an enthusiastic actor who has ideas. He has a real reverence for actors. I think he really respects the process. These guys are nut jobs. In two hours, they're either dead or in cuffs. And it belongs in the theater, and I cannot wait for it to be in the theater. Well! Hopefully, they leave the theater sweating. Stop! You hear me? You're gonna hurt someone! We don't get to walk off into the sunset!